Hello. <clears throat> Number one question is, yes, guys. Why do we need to study Gobros first of all? That's a very basic question. इतना सब है पढ़ने के दुनिया में सब छोड़ के वाई आर वी स्टडिंग कॉकरोच कैन एक्चुअली सम रीजन राइट कैन यू थिंक ऑफ वेरी पॉसिबल रीजन वाई आर वी स्टडिंग अ टाइप ऑफ कॉकरोच कॉल्ड पेरी प्लैनेटा अमेरिका What is the name of the animal? Yeah. So from your side, what could be the possible reasons? Come on, guys. Could be any answer. Bolo. Yes, Aditya. Bolo. To kill. Usko. Kill. Manje kya? To know how to kill it. To how to know how to kill it. Yes. A answer is angle baby. Why we study cockroach na? I can give you two answers. One is a commercial answer, the other is an academic answer. A <coughs> commercial manje. It related to money. Cockroach is a pest. पेस्ट समझते तुम्हारा अपने गोडाउन मध्य जे धान्य वगैरह कॉक्रोच तो डिस्ट्रॉय करते पता कि नहीं इकड़े तक डिजीजेस ऑल्सो इट स्प्रेड्स बरबर ना सो कैन आई से इट कॉजेस इकोनॉमिक लॉस टू ह्यूमन बींग्स डू एग्री सो डोंट यू थिंक वी नीड टू किल इट मेनी अ टाइम्स सो द केमिकल्स दैट वी मेक टू किल इट The hormones that we used to destroy them in large numbers. ये अपने कब पता चलेगा? जब तक उस animal को study नहीं करते, तब तक उसको apply नहीं कर पाए. What my point? The this is the commercial angle. Academic point of view say, <coughs> you are choosing to become doctors. Not everybody chooses to become a doctor, right? There are people who do entomology, study of insects. एंड ऑर्निथोलॉजी स्टडी ऑफ बर्ड्स बरबर ना अपना इंटरेस्ट मेडिसिन मध्य है बट देर पीपल हू डू पी एच डी इन स्पाइडर एंड पी एच डी इन कॉक्रोचेस सो इलेवेन ट्वेल्थ वी स्टडी बायोलॉजी एज अ होल जोलॉजी ऑफ एनिमल जोलॉजी ऑफ ह्यूमन बींग बॉटनी ऑफ प्लांट्स स्टडी ऑफ बैक्टेरिया एवरीथिंग दैट इज वाई वी नीड टू स्टडी दिस एनिमल समझ ला So we study this animal from two angles, from an academic perspective as well as a commercial perspective. And when we study the animal, what do we study? We start with its external morphology. Kashal, let's start with the external morphology. You heard me? Okay. So what do you mean by external morphology, kids? कि जो भी हमको बाहर से दिखता है उस एनिमल का उसको हम लोग क्या करते हैं डिस्क्राइब करते हैं दैट इज कॉल्ड एज एक्सटर्नल ओके लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दैट देन ओके देयर आर मेनी स्पीशीज ऑफ कॉकरोचेस ओके द वन व्हिच वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी सर कैन गिव द वॉच हां नंतर हो गया पढ़ता The animal that we are choosing is going to be the 
reddish brown variety you know you will see that small black ones reddish brown ones so we are studying the reddish brown variety which is called peri planeta america other than that there is blata orientalis peri planeta germanica the commonly found cockroach in india is peri planeta america so what is its habit and habitat okay habitat means रहने की जगह ओके एंड हैबिट हम लोग इंग्लिश में आप मैं हैबिट बोलूंगा आप बोलेंगे आदत वो अलग है जोलॉजी में और बॉटनी में जब हम लोग वर्ड यूज करते हैं हैबिट इट मींस हाउ डज इट स्टे इन इट्स एनवायरमेंट व्हाट आर इट्स स्पेशल अडेप्टेशन लाइक इफ आई टॉक अबाउट अ मनी प्लांट इट्स अ क्लाइंबर अ बैनियन इज अ ट्री पॉइंट मंकी इज आरबोरियल इट लिव ऑन ट्रीज समझ लो वेन यू टॉक अबाउट कॉक्रोचेस देर हैबिट इज देर नॉक्टर्नल नॉक्टर्नल मतलब एक्टिव ड्यूरिंग नाइट टाइम वी आर एक्टिव ड्यूरिंग वी आर डाई यूरनल कॉक्रोचेस आर नॉक्टर्नल समझ लो They are cursorial. Cursorial मतलब fast running animals. Okay. With a high degree of acclimatization. नवीन शब्द है high degree of acclimatization. मतलब वो जल्दी से अपने आप को कोई भी surrounding में adjust कर सकते हैं. और ये characteristic features है arthropods का. Cockroach belongs to a phylum called Arthropoda, a class called Insecta. Okay, the most successful class. Classification के बाद में ना after teaching its morphology ना let's talk about it. So वो अपने आप को कहीं पे भी adjust कर लेता है, हाँ? जैसे कि आपके bag में भी होगा और NASA के space shuttle में भी होगा, हर जगह मिलेगा, है ना? वही तो है, नहीं? And so with respect to its habitat we say that it is omnipresent matlab it is found almost everywhere at different different places samajh lo so cockroach is active during day time or night time so what is the term i use that the animal is nocturnal nocturnal it's a fast running animal so i said it is cursorial <laughs> What it gets? Yes, it can adjust itself to different habitats. So you'll find that it is found almost everywhere. So I said it is omnipresent. Omnipresent. Okay. The color and size we can read it later on. We'll talk about its external. morphology <clears throat> a young one of cockroach young one of cockroach is called as a nymph nymph okay and the nymph changes into an adult it is the nymph that changes Into an adult. <coughs> Other insects, we see the presence of larvae. It is the larva that changes into the adult. Larvae. But during the development of cockroach, what changes into an adult? Yeah. The nymph. Such a development, which involves nymphal stages. ऐसा डेवलपमेंट जहां पे निम्फल स्टेजेस इन्वॉल्व होती है इज कॉल्ड फॉर अ मेटाबोलिस डेवलपमेंट यू टू लर्न द वर्ड बोलो फॉर अ मेटाबोलिस डेवलपमेंट फॉर अ मेटाबोलिस डेवलपमेंट 
metabolism development. It's a type of development where the nymph changes into an adult. Such a development is called coronavirus. Clear? <coughs> the body of cockroach is mainly divided into three parts. They are the head, the thorax, and the abdomen. The three main divisions of the body I mentioned are head, thorax, and the abdomen. The body is covered by a tough exoskeleton. It's a characteristic features of arthropoda. You understand exoskeleton? <coughs> your nails are exoskeleton. But your bones are exoskeleton. Cockroach shows the presence of an exoskeleton. Which is made up of chitin. Okay. So it is covered by a Titanous exoskeleton. Did you get it, class? Yes. What is chitin made up of? Sugars. Amino sugars. Kya bolna start karo? Amino sugars. For upliftment, kya hai na? Polysaccharides. Manje complex carbohydrates. लॉस ऑफ वॉटर फ्रॉम देर बॉडी एंड एज ए लैंड एनिमल तुम्हारा सबसे पहला इश्यू रहता है कि पानी कहाँ मिलेगा मेरे तो तुम्हारे अगर अंदर ऐसे अडेप्टेशन है कि तुम पानी अपने बॉडी के अंदर क्या कर सकते हो सेव कर सकते हो इसका मतलब आपका जोग्राफिकल स्प्रेड कम होगा कि ज्यादा होगा समझ लो मतलब क्या आपके पास अगर ऐसे अडेप्टेशन है जिसकी वजह से आप क्या कर रहे हो वॉटर कंजर्वेशन म्हणजे अर्थ वरचे विभिन्न ठिकाणावरती तुम्ही सर्वाइव्ह करू शकता ओके सो दिस टायटेनियस एक्सोस्टेलन इज वन ऑफ द रीझन दॅट इट्स बॉडी इट्स प्रोटेक्शन अँड इट इज एबल टू डू वॉटर कन्झर्वेशन वॉट इज माय पॉइंट हाय ना If you are looking at a cockroach, this is its dorsal side. This is its and this is the whole thing is covered by exoskeleton. So, my last question is: Can you see a cockroach which is fallen ulta? What is that? Do you see the lines on its body? Yes. Its का मतलब जो exoskeleton है, is it one continuous plate? Or is it divided into smaller, smaller plates? Divided into smaller, smaller plates. Understand? Yes. Do you get my point? Yes. And this chitinous plates of the exoskeleton are called sclerites. Sclerites. Correct. Put it low. Yes. क्या बोला मैंने? Sclerites. The chitinous exo Skeleton plates are called sclerites. So, what do I am trying to tell you? Yes. Ayana. So, if I am looking at the cockroach from the dorsal view, dorsal means what? Vertebral. That's a vertebral cockroach. That is cockroach. Sir, that's a plate, sir. समझ रहा ना 
So what is the plate on the dorsal side called? Sclerite. Now let's go. Sclerite. Sclerite. Okay. Now I'm looking at a cockroach, and I say, this is the dorsal side. This is the lateral side, and this is the ventral side. Okay, what are the different sides? Dorsal side, lateral side, ventral side. And the ventral side. The sclerites on the dorsal side. मतलब I am talking about red और I am talking about black. Red. So the sclerites on which side बचा? Dorsal. Dorsal side. Are called tergia. And the sclerites on the lateral sides. Are called pleurites or pleurons, and the ventral side they are called sterna. Now we know why: dorsal, tergia, lateral, pleurites, ventral, sterna. So, जब एक कॉपरोज उल्टा गिरा हुआ रहता है, तो आपको उसका टर्जा दिखता है कि स्टर्ना दिखता है? और जब डॉर्सली देखते हो तो उसको क्या दिखता है बच्चों तो मतलब सो द स्क्लेराइट्स गॉट डिवाइडेड इनटू एंड ऑल दिस स्क्लेराइट्स आर जॉइंड टुगेदर बाय अ फ्लेक्सिबल मेम्ब्रेन ऑल देम आर जॉइंड टुगेदर बाय अ Flexible membrane called arthroidal membrane. This is a pretty white. Okay. As a result of which the body will get some flexibility. So tergia, sterna, and pleurites are joined together by a flexible membrane. And the flexible membrane is called as which membrane? Arthroidal membrane. Okay. अब देखो जब एक tough titanium exoskeleton होता है, जो तुम्हारे पास नहीं, तुम्हारे पास है? नहीं. तुम्हारे पास क्या है? Skin. है ना covering तुम्हारा skin है ना? और तुम जैसे से grow होते हो, skin क्या होता है? Expand होता है कि नहीं होता? लेकिन ना ये टाइटिन से यूज़ करने के लिए ऐसा नहीं होता। मतलब जैसे अंदर से एनिमल ग्रो होता है, बाहर से टाइटिन से यूज़ करने के लिए एक्सपांड नहीं होता। तो फिर बताओ एनिमल ग्रो कैसा करेगा फिर? क्या ऑप्शन उसके पास? हाँ? इतना भी फ्लेक्सिबल नहीं हुआ आप रोड़ा में भी। ओके? What are the possible options you are thinking? Really? What does a snake do, Bachelor? <coughs> Loudly, I want to hear it. It sheds its covering. It sheds its covering, na? Uh -huh. So does cockroach have that option? Yes. It will remove its <coughs> exoskeleton. And this process is called ecchidysis. Now let's go. Ecchidysis. Or molting. क्या दोस्त को? So can I say the cockroach will periodically after every few days will remove its exoskeleton and this removal of exoskeleton is called what? Ecchidysis or it is called as? Ecchidysis. क्या क्या बात है? It is called ecchidysis or or बन जाए? ग्रेज की और तुम्हारी तलाक हो चुकी है उनसे, ठीक है? Now the nymph undergoes ecchidysis almost thirteen times and it results in the formation of an adult. कितना बार ecchidysis करेंगे बच्चों? कितना कुछ जाओगा? But everybody, तो बंद लगी नहीं? The body is divided into how many parts? Three parts. What are three parts? Three. The thorax is three segmented. 
How many? Three. So how many segments are there on the thorax? Three. First one called prothorax. Middle one, mesothorax. The last one, metathorax. So how many thoracic segments is which are? Three. What are three thoracic segments? Prothorax. They are called pro. Thorax, mesothorax, then mesothorax, and last one is metathorax. Metathorax. Ready, Lakshya? Yes. And the abdomen is ten segmented. So, in an adult cockroach. You have a head, then a thorax, and a abdomen. abdomen. Okay? The head has one large head plate. Thorax has got how many segments, which are? Three, Three segments, which are called pro, meso, and Okay. The abdomen is how many segmented? Ten. Okay. Now, which type of development I said it shows? For a metabolus development. What do you mean for a metabolus development? The name changing into an adenine is called as for a metabolus development. Or the nymph as compared to the head. head. <clears throat> In its head, it has got six clarites. Adult has only adult. Adult has only one. Abdomen may it has got eleven segments. Adult has got? Yes. This does not have a wing. It has got a wing pads. Whereas an adult shows the presence of? Wings. wings. Okay? So can I say the nymph is changing into an? Adult. We call it as metamorphosis in biology. Kya what is karte? Metamorphosis. Kya what is karte? Metamorphosis. Metamorphosis. For this, morpho, manje morphology, metamorphosis, change in morphology. Come on, da. एक छोटी सी बीज है, उसको आपने soil में डाला, एक छोटा plant हुआ, फिर उसकी tree बन गई, उसकी morphology same हुई कि change हुई, दूसरा क्या हुआ? Metamorphosis. Come on, da. And in this metamorphosis, which stage is involved? And such a development, this called which development? For a metamorphosis. Do you get it, Bacha Bhatti? Everybody? Now remember, the head, thorax, and who? Abdomen. Do you see that the head is oval in shape and it is connected almost at right angles to the thorax? That is what sir. Did you hear me what I said? What is the shape of the head? Oval. It is connected to the thorax. And, uh, and what would you know? <coughs> and do you see? There is something that connects it. Ayana. Yes. Is your head connected to your thorax? Your case. Is your head connected to your thorax? Yes. Through a yes. neck. So the neck of cockroach is called a 
cervicum. What do you call it? Cervicum. So the head is connected to the thorax yes. at right angles by a neck, neck. which is called as the cervicum. Saruche? Right? Understanding everybody? Yes. So in the external structure, we will focus first on studying the head of cockroach. Head of the cockroach. Head of the cockroach. And the head of the cockroach shows the presence of different parts. <coughs> what are the different parts on your head? Cockroach is not a bad thing. You are 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 a have you seen earthworm? earthworm? Yes. Huh? An earthworm, can you by, just by seeing tell me which is head and which is tail? No. Difficult. Huh? But in a cockroach? Yes. In a human being? Yes. In a frog? Yes. So can I say the animals that I mentioned in the end, all of them are having a well developed head? Yes. With a brain? Yes. And organs around it? Sense organs around yes. it? Yes. Have you seen a cockroach? Yes. Does it have antennae? Yes. It's a sense organ. Does it have eyes? Yes. yes. <laughs> so the cockroach also has a head yeah. and organs around it. This is called cephalization. What is the word used? Cephalization. So cockroach shows cephalization. Cephal, but the head. Lization. Matlab development. <coughs> Cephalic region. Cephalic region. Head region. Head region. Cora. Cora. Tail. Tail. Cephalic. Cephalic. Doka. Doka. Doka is your grade. And copper is your grade. So, what is the doka development called? <laughs> Doka development is called cephalization. So now this cephalic region will show the presence of compound eyes, antennae, ocelli, and Mouth parts. What are the head shows the presence of a chop? Is there with me everybody? Yes. The mouth parts are of different types. <coughs> Repeat after. Bolo Labrum. Bolo Bolo. Mandible. Mandible. Maxillae. Maxillae. Labium. 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 Hypopharynx. 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 Labrum. Labrum. Mandible. Mandible. Maxillae. Maxillae. Labium. Labium. Hypopharynx. Hypopharynx. So head shows the presence of compound eyes. And the ocelli and the mouth parts. And what are the different mouth parts? Labrum, mandible, maxillary, labrum, and the hypopharynx. Okay? So, tell me <coughs> what are the different habits of cockroach I just mentioned? Hola. <coughs> so, then. So what's the first part we have mentioned which you know? That it shows the presence of 
what? Compound. Compound ice. So laterally on the head. <coughs> laterally on the head. Do you see the presence of a pair of compound eyes? Okay. So how many eyes are there, Vichlo? They are a pair. Can I say the shape of these eyes is kidney shape? Or I can use the word it is B shape. B shape. Now <clears throat> Well, why, why are we using the word compound eyes? What is the difference between simple and compound in biology? Remember, whenever something is entire, <clears throat> it is called simple. Whenever it is divided into smaller parts, The word used is what? Compound. So, you have a leaf or a leaf? Leaf. Do you understand me? But you have a lens in your eyes. Yes. Do you have a single unit or not? Do you have a single unit or not? Do you have a single unit or not? Do you know who will be simple? और कंपाउंड किसको बोलेंगे? समझा कंपाउंड क्यों वर्ड यूज़ था? Because the eyes show the presence of lens. Lens बोलूँ मैं लेंस. And this lens is divided into a number of hexagonal units. The lens is divided to number of hexagonal units. And these hexagonal units are called omatidia. So what is one hexagonal unit called which look? Omatidia. Uma So is it a single lens or a lens broken down into smaller smaller parts? And what is that one hexagonal unit called? And approximately there are about 2000 per eye. Okay? And the because of this omatidia, the cockroach has a blurred mosaic image. Blurred mm -hmm. What do you mean blurred? Dunga. Mosaic ka matlab kya tha bacho? मतलब बचपन में एक पज़ल आता था, कोई भी फोटो आता था, मोनालिसा वगैरह का, या फिर सिनेरी रहती थी, वो जॉइंटेड रहता था ना, तो मतलब अगर कॉकरोच आपकी तरफ देख रहा है, तो आपको आप सिंगल दिखोगे कि किसी छोटे-छोटे जॉइंटेड पार्ट्स दिखेंगे? जॉइंटेड पार्ट्स। ऐसा दिखेगा उसको, ओके? एंड इतना Sensitivity, but they have a less resolution. मतलब थोड़ा भी light है ना, तो उसके वजह से वो लोग image capture कर पाएंगे। लेकिन जो image capture करेंगे ना, वो clear नहीं होगी। उसका resolution कैसा होगा? Blurred. Resolution समझते हैं ना? जैसे camera में कभी-कभी ना एकदम blurred दिखता है, फिर उसकी lens को set करो तो एकदम clear हो जाता है। उसको resolution तो इनका इमेज क्लियर दिखता है वो लोग को नहीं लेकिन थोड़ा भी लाइट रहेगा तो सेंस कर सकते हो कुछ आंखों से सो हवा तो मोटी दिया 
they show the presence of more sensitivity but they have less sensitivity okay what's already did you all get it everybody and in between the two eyes there are white spots a pair of white spots which are called what are they called which look ocella a pair of white spots that are called as ocella ocella and also there are antennal sockets and from these antennal sockets arise a pair of what which look antenna antenna ये जो एंटीने है इनके भी अलग अलग पार्ट्स है आपको नहीं याद रखने इनको एंड द लास्ट पार्ट एज फाइन हेयर्स विच आर कॉल्ड ब्रिसल्स ओके ये सब ब्रश के ऊपर होते हैं ना ब्रिसल्स and these are antennae are for olfactory receptors and tacto receptors i would have easily written receptors for smell and receptors for touch i want to remember these two words olfaction sense of smell and tacto means the sense of touch some of the sarvan na kare nakki okay so their main sense organ is who antenna it helps them to sense the environment for food got it so they show the presence of pair of compound eyes a pair of antenna and a pair of white spots which are ocelli probably they are light receptive photosensitive who ocelli some of them call them undeveloped eyes aise usko alag alag bola jata hai isko ocelli the details of the mouth parts are not there for okay only thing that you need to remember are few points regarding mouth parts is that they are trophy mouth parts what is the word i used trophy mouth parts trophy mouth parts okay here is the like that so this is the mouth and all the mouth parts are there around the mouth are there around the mouth your mouth parts Are they around the mouth or inside the mouth? Inside. But cockroach's case में ये कौन है? Mouth है. ये ऊपर flap दिखा. इसको बोलते हैं labrum. क्या बोलते हैं इसको? Labrum. Upper lip. Upper lip. Upper lip. Do you see this? This is called labium. क्या बोलते हैं इसको? Labium. Lower lip. इसको पाल वगैरह बोलते नहीं याद रखना आपको ओके इन द गवर्नमेंट डज व्हाट इज देयर देयर बट डोंट ओवरलोड योरसेल्फ विद दैट इंफॉर्मेशन इसको क्या कहेंगे लोअर लिप इसको क्या कहेंगे मतलब कौन लेब्रम ये कौन है लोअर लिप मतलब कौन लेबियम ये कौन है माउथ साइड में दो बाइटिंग के लिए मैंडिबल्स है जिसके पास ऐसे जिगजैग मार्जिन होता है और काइटिन रहता है तो वो लोग क्या करते हैं बाइट करते हैं और उसी के साइड से एक मैक्सिला करके आता है क्या होता है जो खाने को इसे पकड़ता है और कहां तक लेके आता है माउथ मैंडिबल उसको क्या करेगा क्रश आलो बी अंडरशूड सो हु इज दिस हु इज दिस हु इज दिस हु इज दिस मैंडिबल एंड हु इज दिस मैक्सिला सो कैन आई से इन फ्रंट ऑफ द माउथ आल्सो देयर इज अ कैविटी 
यस और नो क्यों यस बोला आपने कि माउथ है उसके आगे सब ढक्कन है ना तो उसके आगे भी क्या आ जाएगा कैविटी आएगा उसमें टंग रहता है ऐसा टंग हाइपोफेरिंग्स बोलते हैं क्या उसको देखो इतना सब किसी ने पढ़ा होगा ना कॉकरोच के बारे में तो कॉकरोच की जो माउथ पार्ट्स है ये माउथ के अंदर है कि बाहर है बाहर आजू बाजू में है ना तो उसको हम लोग क्या बोलते हैं ट्रॉफी माउथ पार्ट्स टाइप बच लो बाइटिंग Biting and chewing है। जिसमें मॉस्किटो है ना उसका पियर्सिंग एंड सकिंग टाइप होता है मच्छर के पास पियर्स मतलब पियर्स और सक करना होता है so, बट अपना कॉकरोच के पास कौन सा टाइप है बाइटिंग एंड चुविंग जिसमें लेबर को हम लोग ने क्या बोला अपर लेबियम को क्या बोला आप लोगों ने और हाइपोफारिंग्स को क्या कहा हम लोग Helping jaws and hypophyses. Okay, the names of the parts and all that is not there in it yet. Okay, so stick to this one. Shall we continue? Yes. Okay, all of you. Yes. Thorax, madam. Thorax. How many segments are? Three. On which one? Say. Will you? बोलो आप बोलो एंड तीन है ना सेगमेंट्स द लार्जेस्ट वन इज द प्रो फॉलोड बाय द मीजो एंड ठीक है तो थोरैक्सिक सेगमेंट डॉर्सली शोज द प्रेजेंस ऑफ विंग्स and ventrally it shows the presence of legs matlab in the case of cockroach the thoracic segments dorsally upar ki taraf kya rahenge wings rahenge barabar yes aur niche ventrally kya rahenge legs legs what my point yes. so what do they show the presence of thorax shows the presence of dorsal wings, wings. And ventral legs. Dorsally, which side, bacha? Dorsal. Dorsally. Kya hai? Legs. Aur niche ki taraf kya hai? Legs. Legs. On the meso and the metathorax. There are pair of openings called spiracles. therefore breathing like you got a pair of what nostrils, nostrils na yeah. our cockroach has got a pair of spiracles where on the thorax okay yeah. then there are how many pairs of legs which are three pairs that is prothoraxic नेम ऑफ दाइव इज वॉट आर थ्रो 
मतलब एक जो लेग है उसके पास कुछ पार्ट्स होते हैं उसको होते हैं कॉक्सा ट्रोकेंटर फीमर टिबिया टारसोमियस फाइव टारसोमियस टूगेदर इज कॉल्ड टारसस क्लॉज चिपचिपा पैड कॉल्ड एरोलियम इट्स नॉट देयर इन एनसीआरटी रोड लग है सो ये लेग सिंगल है के जॉइंटेड है बच्चों जॉइंटेड जॉइंटेड सो दैट इज व्हाई देयर कॉल्ड वो पीछे अपेंडिक्स बच्चों जॉइंटेड अपेंडिक्स जॉइंटेड अपेंडिक्स आई बात समझ में सबको so is it a single leg or made up of multiple parts multiple parts multiple parts padhne wale to ye bhi padha hai ye jo front pair of legs hai na they are for breaking breaking matlab gaadi rukane ke liye ye jo middle wale hai na ye bhagne ke liye as well as break maarne ke liye aur jo last wale rehte hai na wo sirf kiske liye bhagne ke liye dekh kitni detail mein study kari re kaun कैसा भागता है कहां से ब्रेक मारता है आई मैं मोर देन टाइम इंटरेस्ट है अपना इंटरेस्ट क्या है इंस्टा नहीं फिर कुछ इंटरेस्ट ही नहीं है हमारा क्लियर एवरीबॉडी एंड डॉर्सली दे शो द प्रेजेंस ऑफ टू पेयर्स ऑफ विंग्स कितने पैरों के लिए बच्चों टू पेयर्स ऑफ विंग्स ओके सो थोड़ा एक्सी कितने सेगमेंट से था एक बार फिर से बताओ मुझे रो मीजो और बेटा ओके ना द फर्स्ट पेयर ऑफ विंग arises from the mesothorax and the second pair of wing arises from the metathorax so wings kitne bachche log do kaun se kaun se prothoracic wing i'm sorry the first pair and the second pair first pair is which pair bachcho lo meso and the second pair is what the first pair of wing is called tegmina kya dosto tegmina pyq ka yahi sal the first pair of wing tegmina It is thick and it is opaque. Is that it? Yes, it is opaque. Thick and opaque. Opaque. And it is used for protection. मतलब ये blue color के wings approach हमेशा अपने feet के ऊपर रखता है ताकि नीचे का feet और नीचे के wings क्या रहे protected रहे. Okay. So it does not use them for flight. Whereas the second pair of wings. They are called elytra. What are they called? Elytra. Mind clear? Clear? Do you know? Yes. So what do you use the elytra? Yes. So what is the second pair of wing called? Elytra. Yeah, yeah. Not mentioned in the entirety, but Tegmina is mentioned, so you need to remember that. And this are true wings. They are thin. And how are they? Transparent. कैसे ये विंग्स थिन है और ट्रांसपेरेंट आई वाज ओल्डर सो थोरैक्स गोट डिवाइडेड टू हाउ मेनी सेगमेंट्स थ्री सेगमेंट्स व्हाट आर थ्री सेगमेंट्स थोरैक्स मेटाथोरैक्स एंड मेटाथोरैक्स वेट विद योर डी एंड द थोरैक्स शोज द प्रेजेंस ऑफ टू पेयर्स ऑफ ओपनिंग्स व्हाट आर द टू पेयर्स ऑफ ओपनिंग्स कॉल्ड स्पेराकल्स and the spiracles help in respiration respiration that is gaseous exchange right bachcho yes. and it has got 
थ्री पेयर ऑफ लेग्स एंड टू पेयर ऑफ लेग्स थ्री पेयर ऑफ लेग्स आर फ्रॉम द राइट द लेग्स आर कॉल्ड जॉइंटेड और जैसे अपने पास रहता है फीमर टिबिया वैसे उनके पास कॉक्सा ट्रोकैंटर फीमर टिबिया टार्सस टार्सोमी ऐसा सब रहता है ठीक है एंड विंग्स भी कितने पेयर है दो कहा करा कहा से अराइज होता है आज के लिए Thank <laughs> you.